Hi guys, welcome. And uh, this is my privilege that I am here and I'm sharing myself, my thought and my emotion regularly. And I am again here after a certain interval of time. And today I am feeling so diligent. My dear friends, I hope especially in this war torn situation whenever the Ukraine and Russia are fighting constantly these things are of a greater significance and I can say how our Indian government evacuated those students from the war torn Ukraine this is a massive step that was not taken before by any government and uh, how the Indian government evacuated those students from the war torn Russia and the Ukraine as well. In this conflict based scenario, one thing is clear that if any country really works willingly, then no job seems tough especially the concern what I'm going to show here is the Indian government's effort to evacuate their students from the war toward Russia and the Ukraine because uh, the students are the real wealth of any country and upon the strength of the students that country depends means directly or indirectly the students of any country are its intellectual wealth especially and uh, protecting the students means the protecting the country's intellectual wealth so most important and sophisticated thing is that the war is not in our hand but to protect our students from the war bound Ukraine is our government responsibility and uh, which our government shows so very well because war is not a solution but I can say the war is the solution uh, this situation when I see from the light of Srimad Bhagavad Gita then our Prabhu says in the Bhagavad Gita that Non-violence policy is the best, but no doubt to protect the righteousness from the non-righteousness, the war is the best. And without fighting war, the righteousness can't be preserved for a long time. This is what the path that was showed by our Bhagavan Sri Krishna 5200 years before on the holy land of Kurukshetra and uh, what today Russia is uh, doing is uh, I'm not going to suggest is it right or wrong but uh, I think they are fighting for their culture they are fighting for their Russian names their Russian nationalism and uh, I think the situation will definitely come out and everything will be set up like before as it was so my main concern uh, that uh, what I felt about these things that our India and uh, Indian nationalism are on top and uh, one thing is clear how especially in this adverse situation the Russia as well as the Ukraine government and many neighborhood countries that are associated with those especially Hungary, Romania, Bulgaria, Moldova, Poland how they associated those students in their country how they accommodated our Indian student in their country is a matter of keen interest and uh, I really well appreciate their efforts to save all Indians 
and uh, to protect them from the bombardments, to protect them after giving themselves shelter and uh, how these are things that happened there. I salute, I respect that how Indian lives matter because this is the government which already shows that the Indian life matters the most and this is the result that shown what I'm going to say at this time. So in my main concern is what I'm going to focus is the concern of uh, Indian citizen. I I am very proud to be an Indian. Whenever I see my Indian flag, Tiranga, the tricolor flag, I, my heart is filled with the positive emotions, the feeling of nationalism, and uh, what I see the Tiranga, my jokes is on top. So, whenever I see the Tiranga, I feel very, very, very proud. I love you, Russia. I love you. I know your nationalism which kind of the nationalism, what are your sentiments so I can understand how your feelings there so I especially thank for all of the Russian that how they keep our Indian students especially I will say Bolshoi Aspasiba Bolshoi Russians and one thing is clear when the bombardment was continuous then the bombardment stopped when they saw the Indian flag covered buses so this is an immense thing these things kept me very happy and I can say this is a very good sign that our India Indian flag Indianism is in a very top and a positive mood so I hope uh, this feeling is a true national feeling and on the basis of the nationalistic sentiment I am gonna share it with you on YouTube via Wikitalks. Jai Hind. Namaste.